welcome back. So today is day one of classroom setup vlogs. Hopefully I will be done with this classroom by Friday. Today is Monday and I have daycare for the next five days. So I'm gonna take advantage and I'm gonna try really hard to get this room set up and finished before Friday. So I'm just gonna take you guys around and show you what I'm currently working with. Um, it does not appear that the carpets have been cleaned. There was an email sent out about a week ago saying that they weren't done, they didn't know when they'd be done. But at this point, I'm like, I don't really care if they're done or not. Like, bring a vacuum in here, it's fine. Um, my carpets aren't really that dirty, so I'm not gonna worry about it. Um, I'm gonna just start setting up. So, um, I'm just gonna show you guys what I'm working with currently and sort of like my game plan for the day and then we'll get started. So this is everything that I brought from home. The tubs are not staying here. These were just vessels for me to get things here. Um, most of the things that you're seeing were in my back to school haul. So if you are interested in watching that, I will link it in the iCard here at the top. And then my bookshelves, or not my bookshelves, my coveys have been covered. I will uncover those. I have some furniture that I need to put together, so I will probably do that today just because I do have my drill and it's nice in here and it'll kind of postpone me moving furniture right away. Um, this is all of the furniture that I have. It's kind of just pushed up against the wall. I think I'm probably gonna get rid of this table and just give it to Mandy next door because I have an idea for my small group area which will mean I don't need this table for myself anymore so I can get rid of that one and use this one for students. I'm planning on moving this piece and this piece over here where my backpack hooks are. I'm gonna take them down. That's one of my projects I wanna do today. And then just furniture. I wanna get rid of this. So I'm gonna roll out a table, empty this and put everything that's in it on a table so that I can put it on the to-go list. But this is what I'm currently working with. Everything in the middle is gone. I'm planning to try to do a wood wall, but I don't think I'm gonna do it. I think it's just too much work. Um, I don't think that it's really worth it, so I might just take this board down and recreate it since I'm gonna have my tall guy back there, and if not, I might just leave it since it's like the perfect size. We shall see. I think the first thing that I wanna do is start building some furniture. So I have this guy I need to build. This is a storage piece. And then this guy that I need to build, which is one of those Ikea eight square, eight cube bookshelf things. I'm gonna use that for my own personal desk. So I'm gonna get started putting furniture together and um, we'll enjoy today's vlog. This piece is done. Now we're working on that piece. Mandy's now here. Hello! Hello! It's hot. Oh, yeah, I'm sweating. <laughs> I'm sweating. So we're working on furniture. I have this piece and then a cart left, but the cart's like super easy. And then I'm gonna start moving stuff. If I didn't vlog it, it didn't happen.
everyone. So I have pulled the tables from the front and the back of the room. I still have to pull those two, but I'm gonna start piling stuff that's inside these and on top, just on these tables, because I'm going to move this and this over here. I'm gonna take this wall down and remove my backpack hooks. And I think what I'm gonna do is put this wooden guy here and then this long one right next to it. Take this, whoa, are you okay? Are you broken? No, I'm okay. Okay. Um, take this wall down and then center it over that long thing. That way I have room for my backpack bins right there. Why are you laughing? Did you, what did you do? <laughs> really? How do you do that? I was trying to move them. <laughs> Just don't sit on them. Oh, it'll make the cut. Oh, it'll make the cut, 100%. Okay, so the mess has to be bad before it can get better. So all of this stuff came from inside those cupboards, this bookshelf, and this bookshelf. So I'm gonna leave it all here until I'm 100% certain that I'm leaving the furniture where it's staying so that I can put all of it away. I also have to go buy two smaller bookshelves and I'm gonna get these same ones that Mandy has because they were $15 at Target. I'm gonna get two of those to put my library on. My aid will be in the window again, just like last year because she loves it over there. And then this is back here now and there's space for my computer cart right there. So that is perfect. And my printer. And this is getting removed right there, that thing. So I think we're looking good here. Has to get worse before it gets better, right? Hey guys, okay, so progress. I have placed my desk space over here. I'm gonna do my library space here. We still have a long way to go before things are presentable. So right now I'm starting to unload these bins and sort of organize things onto tables so that I can organize them later. <laughs> so I'm putting binders and like curriculum on this table. I'm putting containers and storage on this table. And then I'm gonna start putting some things inside other bins to now then put away. So yeah, I don't know if it's gonna stay this way, but for right now, this is my desk space. I sort of, kind of want to put the two black tables in front of it, but I don't know yet. The beauty of the tables is that I can move them, so long as I keep them clear and have all the stuff that I need access to back here, and just keep the tabletops completely cleared. So, I also don't know if that's going to stay there. We will see. All right, you guys, so it has been a super long day. It is now 5 o'clock. I've been here since 9. And so far, so good. I think I'm gonna be ready to finish bulletin boards tomorrow. 
And so I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you guys what I've done just to summarize the day. So I really, I really wanted to do an accent wall, but I knew that this wall was gonna be really difficult because it's all the way up and down. And I also really wanted to use this shiplap paper behind my desk, since my desk is all black furniture. I thought this would be really cute with all the black. But I knew I couldn't put two different shiplap colors on one wall, so I decided to do this entire wall wood paper. And I think I'm gonna do this entire wall black paper with colored borders and like make a few different bulletin boards that go all the way up and down. Like I'll put one giant board right here. I'll do a board there. I'll do something above my desk. And then I have an entire black wall and an entire wood wall. So I did this all by myself. I did get a little bit of help here and there with a couple of things. But for the most part, I did this by myself. I like it. It's like the smallest wall in here that doesn't have all the way top to bottom because this whole spot right here, I did not go all the way down. So like if you look behind it, you can still see blue in there, but that will be covered. There will be something there anyway. So yeah, so tomorrow I'm gonna focus on getting bulletin boards put up. I'm going to finish my library, I still need to get two more bookshelves because of all these books that I got. All these books, and then those two boxes in there are full of books, so I definitely need more. My computer cart's gonna go right there, so that space needs to be empty. And then I need to obviously put more stuff away. All of this on this table is decor that I need to like either pitch or put up. All of this is like curriculum binders that need to be emptied. And then over here is empty bins that I can store things in. Over there is more like curriculum books that I need to just put somewhere. I also decided to do these two rows or columns, I guess, of cubbies to be storage. So I have like my lit sets in there, my Arizona textbooks, my dictionaries and I'll put some more there and then do 24 cubbies going this way. Because this table's kind of in the way, if there were a student like this student wanted to get in his cubby while this was going on, he wouldn't be able to get in there. So I figure if I start the cubbies right here, then this table isn't blocking. Also this, I need to paint. Ooh, that's crooked. I need to paint this black. I'm gonna put some plants, some indoor plants on that and then do some more storage in there. And yeah, this is what's going on in here today. I decided to put this in here because I am gonna start trying to get up early and shower and then just get ready at school. So I bought this on Prime Day, it was like 10 bucks. And I'm gonna keep like another curling iron in here, maybe like a brush, some makeup just so I can get ready. And I put all my nurse things in here, so like first aid, and then these are like obviously things that kids might need. And then I plan to get an over the door mirror to go here just for myself so I can get ready at school. Because I live so far, I like to get ahead of the traffic, which is why I leave super early. So all I'm gonna do next year is try to just get up, shower, get dressed, walk out the door, and then finish getting ready once I get to school. That way I can just have less traffic. So, I'm gonna turn on all the lights, pack up my stuff, and get on out. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for day two of Classroom Setup.